St. Joe Live Movie Reviews, brought to you by Reese Nichols. If you've been waiting for that thriller that's going to keep you on the edge of your seat, wait no longer. Emily Blunt, Benicio Del Toro, and Josh Brolin star in Sicario. In this movie, Blunt plays Kate Macer, an FBI agent recruited by a smooth-talking government official for a task force against the escalating war on drugs. Led by the Shalloway Alejandro, the team travels back and forth across the U.S.-Mexican border using one cartel boss to flush out a bigger one. Bob, seeing all the trailers and everything, right. what did you think going into this and what did you think of the movie? Well, going into it, you think it's going to be a straight-ahead story, kind of like traffic and something like right. that. It's not. This is a very unique perspective. It's a straightforward narrative. Nothing really totally dramatic in terms of storytelling here. Just a very hard story, a very dense story to tell. And luckily, the filmmakers brought in this character, Kate, played by Emily Blunt, to kind of help us introduce it. And they do it in such a cool way that they just drop you with her in the middle of this thing with their lingo and their stuff, and you're just along for the ride, learning along the way. It's one of those rare films that kind of I don't know, respects the intelligence of the audience a little bit, right. you know. Uh, a lot of great characters in this one, uh, not really black, not really white. They kind of walk this weird gray line. Right, I agree. And I think that it, uh, as the as Kate Mace or Emily Blunt does a great job of kind of channeling all the emotions that I think the audience is feeling Absolutely. too. There's feelings of confusion and just seeing all these grim, gross things Her that are going on. reaction shots are just like, she's like, we're, we're doing the same thing as the audience. It's right. It's incredible, and I think Benicio Del Toro gives a great performance as kind of this shadowy guy. Mm -hmm. We don't know, is he good, is he bad, why is he doing the things that he's doing? Mm -hmm. It's just, uh, just fantastic. Even in the last frames of the film, we really don't know who's good and who's bad, and it just keeps the audience guessing all the way to the end. This is, again, a straightforward approach to a very tough subject, but an excellent job along the way, too. This is about four and a half out of five Joes for me. Right. I'm going to give this one four and a half Joes out of five. To read my review, check out St. Joe Live in Friday's edition of the St. Joseph News Press. And you can catch me at 99.3 FM and Tuesdays at the Front Row Film Series at the East Hills Library Theater. And you can catch us next week as we review the Joseph Gordon-Levitt movie, The Walk. Until then, I'm Andrew Gogg. I'm Bob Schultz. We'll see you later.